Hey family, welcome back to Lightworks Intuitive Healing. This is going to be a quick energy check-in, a blackout read. Um, picking up something in the energy and I just want to tap in to give you guys a heads up for whatever this is. If you're new to the channel, thank you so much for clicking on the video. Hopefully there will be something here that will be beneficial to you and help you on your spiritual awakening journey. Okay, I'm seeing it split the deck here on in indecision and judgment. Okay. Hmm. I feel like there's someone that's trying to escape judgment. Someone that's causing, uh, what's this? Yeah, some envious energy. I'm using the soul's journey card. Okay, but before we get into this, let's go ahead. Oh, to my continued supporters, subscribers. I love you guys so much. You guys are awesome. I am so grateful to be able to come on here and just to give you guys words of encouragement and hopefully it's really helping you guys. Thank you for the likes, the shares, the comments, the subscribes and uh, donations as well. If you're interested in donating to the channel or you need to know anything about me, the information will be in the description box. Okay, so let's go ahead and take a few deep breaths. Most high like God, spirit guides, divine ancestors, archangels, and guardian angels, we thank you for your love, your guidance, and your support. Most high God, please allow me to channel the current energies for the collective. Let there be none of me and all of you. Please allow Archangel Michael to be present to provide us with protection. And please close the door on anything that is not of the highest white light. Please and thank you. All right, y'all, let's see what's going on. Holy Spirit, what is this energy I'm feeling? What is this about? What should we be aware of? Okay, we got service in the reverse. Yeah, okay. There's somebody that doesn't like the fact that you're in service, that you're disciplined with this discipline card coming out. Somebody that's very envious of you, okay? got friendship on the reverse in the bottom of the deck okay we got regret okay so there's some type some person that regrets destroying a relationship or a friendship with you yeah we have love here and friendship they destroyed this relationship with you now we have adversity and forgiveness okay um, guilt okay and peace okay i feel like there's someone in your energy that is facing judgment because of something that they did to you okay now they are regretting what they did while in the past they were envious and um yeah blame on the bottom of the deck they put the blame on you and now they see you stepping into purpose being in service and they really can't stand it however they know that they're under judgment and they have to face this karmic debt and now they want to try to come in to resolve something only I don't feel that it's genuine I feel like they're trying to pull the wool over the eyes of the universe which is virtually impossible okay I split the deck on growth okay they're not really willing to grow they're only trying to make the universe believe that they're growing, that they're changing. Anything else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, with imagination on the back, of, on the bottom of the deck. They want the universe to see this image of them trying to uh, be positive, be of service. And it's, yeah, with failure, they're not, the universe is not convinced. Yeah, I pulled the deck open on worry and grief. Yeah, somebody's stressing right now. Grief popped out. Let's get some energy. Holy Spirit, can you tell us more about this energy? 
Let's put the deck on door to spirit and broken heart, okay? The Holy Spirit is not playing, okay? It's time for people to pay their karmic debt. Uh, judgment is upon us all at this time. And if you're in the line of fire when the Most High is uh, delivering this karma, if you did not adhere to what the Most High wanted you to do, it is what it is, okay? Somebody's dealing with financial constraint, constraints and could be dealing with issues with their heart just saw the heart chakra yeah could be dealing with uh, headaches with the crown here yep healer of the ages popped out this card is being represented today by the most high God and God is not playing God is not playing I've been really in this energy at this uh, karma and Dharma energy for the last month or so and people the effects are really here you know it's no more it's coming it's already here and people yep action on the bottom of the deck people thought it was a joke people think we're just talking goddess of the moon secrets are coming out throat chakra okay, archangel gabriel archangel michael okay it's it's go time it's here What else, Holy Spirit? Can you give us more message? Ooh, something flew out. Okay, we got the thinking woman in the reverse, okay? Yep, deceit, bottom of the deck, okay? Somebody that was plotting. Somebody was thinking very low vibrational thoughts of how they could stop you, okay? Who comes out? Archangel Michael, all over that. Taking action, action on the bottom of the deck for this woman holding a heart, okay? Queen of Cups energy. We got strategy beneath that. People were strategizing. They're still strategizing. Storm warning. Trying to bring a storm into your life. What else, Holy Spirit? We have garden in the gate, anxiety thinking man in reverse okay this is their energy all of these cards are in reverse they have no spiritual protection they're still thinking low vibrational thoughts and now the anxiety they're trying to escape this anxiety because this storm warning is in the upright and so is the most high and these storms are about to hit if they haven't already okay so be be beware <laughs> some of these energies that uh you were clear that they didn't have your best interest. They, are, they clearly showed you. Now they're going to come back in decision again on the bottom of the deck. Making you, trying to make you think that it really wasn't what it was, okay? Oh no, I didn't feel that way about you. I'm not sure why you feel that way. As if God, Archangel Michael, your whole spirit team, and you didn't see the truth. Don't fall for it. What else, Holy Spirit? It's all deceit, okay? Whoa. Yeah, these people see you, angel of love and goddess of the moon. Some of you are very intuitive. Some of you can see straight through these people, okay? Keep your eyes open. We got victory and caring connections. Yeah, they're pissed off because you've got new relationships coming in that are actually people that really will care about you and treat you the right way. And it bothers people. People want you to be uh, in this anxiety, thinking that the world is against you. And that's just not what it is. Holy Spirit, let's get some tarot. Fear not, I'm hearing. Yeah, we got the Ace of Cups on Knight of Swords, okay? Trying to rush in to destroy this love offer that the Most High is bringing in for you. It's a no, it's a no. I'm just shaking my head, y'all. These people. <laughs> How can you be under karma, under judgment, and still... Look at this. Three of Pentacles, Ace of Cups. Trying to destroy somebody. Collaborating and plotting. What baffles me is how you think that God does not see everything that you're doing. I don't understand how people don't know that. Okay, we got the Three of Swords. They're trying to plot. 
for you to have a broken heart. It's not going to happen. Okay, 10, 10 on the phone. The Wheel of Fortune and the Ace of Cups, okay? Karma is, the wheel is spinning in your favor, okay? You got Dharma, you got the good karma, okay? The Most High sees how you're progressing, how you're moving forward, how you're being obedient, how you're trying to uplift the world and not contaminate it like others. Holy Spirit, what is the message? Yeah, somebody's stubborn. That's what they're telling me. Somebody is really stubborn. Somebody is they refuse to lose, okay? So they wanna they wanna box with God. <laughs> Good luck. Yep, ace of swords, tower, four of wands, three of cups, okay? In the reverse though, okay? They're trying to escape the tower, they're trying to hold back the truth. They want to turn your stability upside down and they don't want to see you celebrating, okay? But the most high is saying, flip this over. <laughs> okay, God is bringing in that tire, tower. Tire, okay? Somebody may need to check on their tires. Yeah, somebody needs to check their tires, okay? Um, ooh, that's on both ends. Collective, make sure your tires are in good shape. There, there's nothing in them. Okay, somebody could have put something in your tire or they just may need to be checked out or replaced. Okay, um, however, God is bringing in this tower. This is the truth, Ace of Swords. Okay, you do have a, a stable home life, you do have stability coming in, and you will be celebrating very soon. There's nothing these people can do about it. Queen of Wands on the bottom of the deck. You are creating this beautiful life. We got the Queen of Wands and the Magician. Okay? Yeah. Nothing they can do. What else, Holy Spirit? Too many. Three of Swords, Seven of Cups. Want you to be heartbroken and confused. The damsel in distress energy. It's a no. You're the Queen of Swords, okay? Queen of Swords, Emperor energy, okay? You're a boss. You're very strategic, very smart. You're not a damsel. You don't need anyone to carry you or help you, okay? You got God. You got your spirit team. You're good. Don't let this person come in and say they're going to ace of pentacles on the bottom of the deck. Split the deck again on the emperor. Okay, don't let these people uh, come in and try to make you feel like, yeah, plant these seeds with the seven of pentacles in your head to make you think like, look what we got. Seven of pentacles, ten of swords, queen of swords, okay? You already see it. I'm surprised the high priestess is not out here. They planted the these seeds, they betrayed you, stabbed you in your back, and now you're in your Queen of Swords energy. You're fully balanced. <laughs> and you see this fake love offer coming in, okay? You're not trying to hear that. What else, Holy Spirit? Yep, Queen of Wands, Five of Wands, okay? They wanna disrupt you. We got Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands, okay? Very powerful energy, very powerful. They're still trying to come for you. Why? I don't know. We already saw multiple angels out here. Yep, and King of Wands. Okay, I'm getting counterpart. King of Wands, Queen of Wands. Okay, they're trying to stop that from happening. Bottom of the deck, we have the Justice. Okay, need I say any more? Okay. I knew I felt some kind of little nasty energy, so I just wanted to get on here and give you guys a heads up. So, yep, they're still trying it. Not to worry. Cleanse your energy. Shake it off. Just stay ready so you don't have to get ready. Know they're coming. Keep your vibrations high. Don't, don't give them anything to attach themselves to. Be grateful. 
Thank the Most High. Thank your angels. Thank your spirit guides. They're working hard for you to keep you safe from these energies. Okay. I love you guys so much. Have a beautiful day. Until next time, peace and blessings.